Hi everyone, I'm here with Vizio's new flagship soundbar, the Elevate. This system has all the bells and whistles you'd expect from a system like this, including Dolby Atmos and Wi-Fi streaming, plus it has a pretty unusual and revolutionary feature. If there's one brand that's making home theatre more affordable to everyone, it's Vizio. The company makes some excellent soundbar and subwoofer systems, starting from around $100. While at $999, the Elevate isn't cheap, it's doing things no other bar can do at any price. This Vizio is called the Elevate for one main reason, this revolving height speaker. When you're listening to standard material, for example music or even 5.1 surround movies, the speakers stay in place. Vizio says in this position they help to bolster the main output. But when the soundbar detects a Dolby Atmos or DTS-X signal, they flip up to point at the ceiling. The sound then bounces down at you, bringing you height effects. The front section of the bar is metal, while the rear section is vinyl and plastic. It's a large speaker at four foot wide and six inches deep. The front of the bar features a colored LED and a voice prompt informing you about which input you're on. The soundbar comes with a very large wireless sub and it can put out a lot of bass. The system also includes dedicated rears with more ceiling firing drivers inside. The only potential issue with these is that they have wires connected them to the sub. So if you put the sub next to your TV, you need somewhere to put the 30 foot of cables. The remote control comes with a screen and is the main way you'll interact with the Elevate. There's a bunch of buttons on it which will help you to set up the system, but there's no auto calibration mode. An on-screen display would help make this easier, but that would also add to the cost. The Elevate offers two separate HDMI inputs, which means you can connect several different devices. In addition, it includes an HDMI EARC port for connecting to your TV. This gives you the flexibility of using your TV as a switch if you have a lot of different video sources, consoles, streaming players, etc. And the EARC standard can pass through Dolby Atmos if you have a new TV. The system also includes optical, two 3.5mm inputs, USB and Bluetooth. The Elevate connects to your network over Wi-Fi and includes Spotify Connect and Chromecast built-in, but not Apple AirPlay. How does the Vizio Elevate sound? Very, very good. The Vizio runs rings around the $800 Sonos Arc and is helped along by the dedicated sub and rears. And it's especially good with music. This has been a strength with most of the Vizios I've heard and I'm glad to hear it continue with the Elevate. While I was watching TV, it was easy to forget I was listening to a soundbar, as the sound was full and detailed when it needed to be. You may need to increase the levels of the height speakers though, as they can seem a little reticent compared to the main system. But overall, this is a great system to watch a movie, whether it's in standard surround or in Atmos. Does the Elevate really need to have those revolving speakers? Not really, but it is really cool. And the soundbar is able to play music convincingly, for example, which means that the speakers are able to perform its split duties well. While it's not exactly an affordable product and it isn't suited to newbies, the Vizio Elevate is a great alternative to a receiver and surround speaker system. And it's a lot more affordable too. If you want something that sounds good and looks even better, there is no other system that does what the Vizio Elevate can. This has been Ty Pendlebury for CNET.com.